through here.
I think we should go out like Eugene. From a stroke? No, oh, from old age, like living a long life. You? No way, come on, you're way too reckless. Oh, look who's talking. Well, you'll probably die from hypothermia from wearing canvas sneakers in the snow. I am wearing boots today. You know how you're gonna die? Who, let me guess, you're gonna kill me? <laughs> Did I ruin your punchline? No. Maybe. Fuck you. <laughs> Sorry. Under here. What the gameplay needs to do is immerse you in the world, give you as many interesting actions to survive in this world and overcome obstacles. And obstacles could be infected, it could be other people, it could just be the environment, it could be rushing water. Anything that could happen in this post-apocalyptic world. Are you clean? Yeah. And that's where we added um, a jump button. Deal. <laughs> in the first game, we had a clamor button, but not really jumping. <clears throat> and here, Ellie can jump. The combat scenarios are much more vertical, where Ellie can use elevation to her advantage. I see spores in there. Masks on. Got it. Remember, I don't want to have to shit you in the face. Oh, that's so sweet. All these spores mean they've been here for a while. Keep your eyes peeled for older infected. Yep. Is this part of the supermarket? I don't know. I think we're above it. Let's get to the ground floor. Blind motherfuckers make my skin crawl. Let's make sure the rest of the building's cleared out. And then get the fuck out of here. Speak in my language. Oh, fuck. Hey, we got another trespasser. A girl. Did you see her? 
No, but the fucking guy is nearby. Shit. We're looking for two. The fuck's all that smoke? He blew up one of our trucks. How'd you let that happen? Just find them. I want those fucking trespassers! Got something. I'll go see what's up. if they weren't. I hate these small groups. Big groups, it's a straight fight. These loners, they could be hiding anywhere. Would it be useful?
There you go. this some kind of bomb When you enter new spaces, you want to look around for supplies. You want to open drawers and cabinets um, and look for decisions that you've already made. Like you, you are continuing this through line of her journey through this world. Uh, and the moment to moment gameplay is influenced by that in a way that we haven't before. The realization that your choices have these long term consequences is very much like the nature of the, the narrative of the game choices and overlaps that you can do in any moment and in, in on the fly. We try to be a game that wants you to make a lot of different decisions in combat as possible. And the way that we've expanded the recipe roster and all of the recipes and how they interact with each other is carefully chosen for the different ingredients and making sure that you always have these interesting decisions to make. <laughs> 